everyone it's Nezzy welcome or welcome back to my channel Nezzle and to another vlog in today's video I am here at the Radisson Hotel for day three of an awesome conference that I've been attending called Unleash and this is a really wonderful initiative that is being put on by the creative industry of our government here in Grenada and it is geared towards creatives whether you're in the field of music fashion dance videography photography art you know like visual arts all of it is being represented here it's been a great two days so far i've attended as many sessions as i could and today we're wrapping it all up with a workshop this morning there's another panel discussion and there's a wonderful exhibition and concert later i really should have vlogged from the beginning to show you guys what we've been up to but i figured better late than never so today i'm going to show you guys everything that i'm able to attend today and hopefully it's something you'll enjoy but i do really applaud this initiative by our government it is really great to see light being shined on creatives and this avenue that has opened up for us it was a totally free conference they fed us which is always a plus for me and they brought in these really really amazing speakers while also featuring some awesome local talent so it has been really enriching all of the sessions were also streamed live so you do have the option to go and look at them i don't know if they'll be left up permanently but i will try to link them in the description below so you can check them out if you're interested So guys, as you can see here, the conference, as I said, is being put on by the Grenada Office of Creative Affairs. And this is a new ministry or so within the government. So far, I'm really, really excited about what they're doing. We now have the ability to register online with them. You can apply for concessions and so, and they're really trying to push the creative industry forward. So that's really awesome because for a long time, it felt like, you know, being a creative in Grenada can't really get you too far, but now, you know, there's more hope. So, that's great. Thank you. So I signed up for film and multimedia, so I'm looking forward to this session and hopefully learning quite a lot so that I can improve the quality of content that I bring to you. on the sort of producer side. I'm going to move over to, over to Mishida, who's on the distribution side. I am a creative entrepreneur. I think that's the best way of framing it. I function as a filmmaker. I have produced two films here in Grenada. Uh, so I'm Simon Frederick. I'm an uh, artist, photographer, filmmaker, director, and producer. I really don't know what my passion is yet. So I came here today to find out what I like and what piques my interest. Who's going to make the first movie? What is it? What are these movies going to be? Okay, who's going to make the first one? So the day has been going really well so far. We had two sessions this morning, then there were workshops. I only attended one because I was just interested in the film and media workshop. I think that's what it was called. Something to that effect. And then I had to run out for a bit. Then I came back in, I had my lunch. I popped into the panel discussion that they were having about one Caribbean and now I am about to take in the exhibition. So there are some really awesome creations on exhibit here today and so I am going to show you some of them as many as I'm able to and there are also going to be some performances so hopefully I can catch a few. But I hope that you guys were enjoying seeing what today was like. This conference overall has been really motivating and encouraging. So I'm just really hoping that coming out of all of this, we'll be able to see some real change and growth in the industry, you know, feel the support of the government more and really see creatives, you know, flourish in Grenada. So anyway, I have yapped on enough. Let me show you some of the exhibits. So here we have some yes. products. Yes. The brand is Marie They are all natural creations as you can see here. The prices are pretty affordable. These here are 15 EC for these stoppers. Lovely earrings here are 50 EC. 
products can be found in the art and spice creation which features things like art and spice and fashion and all of that next the marinos mahogany design then we have mahogany design yes okay so here we see mahogany design to really oh, i like this so one what these are made out of yes excel excel earrings so you can actually go as big and bold as you want but mm. without the the let me see the discomfort of pain from a heavy airing so it's very light because it's, so all it's of these made. are extra well, like those are looking like an extra kind of design oh. these here mm. these are extra very so nice. do things with seashell sea glass coconut this is resin you know so this is a leaf which is hand painted it's an actual leaf it's an actual leaf yes oh my gosh and then this leaf are cut a little smaller because not everybody likes it so, so big yeah <laughs> you know so now we'll put fabric as well it's a fabric airing and then this one is uh, wooden so i painted it the airing so all right so we have anna costa with marinos and Leisha williamson with mahogany design mahogany design <laughs> all right thank you okay you're welcome here we have some books by local authors i was just able to meet the author of a grenada nyabingi who is prince nana this book is for the movies mm. because it have some very extraordinary qualities in it ah. things that should be recorded and documented okay so how do you sell it fifty dollars fifty dollars and yeah. where can persons get it well they could get it at a mall mm. and they could get it on the astronaut mall also okay so in the mall that's the bookstore in the mall yeah okay. yeah oh, thank you yeah. you're really welcome all right guys and it's also on amazon so you can order it if you are outside of being able so here are some other books by local authors these here are by ricardo james douglas he was presenting this morning and then we have this one here which is on creole and i actually know the person who wrote my wrote these here are all by mr ambrose who i just had the pleasure of meeting we're looking at crime fiction children's drama culture slash historical uh, fiction out of Karaku. Mm -hmm. Zone 1 is a short story that's set right here in Gandans. Nice. So we are all... Zone 1? Zone 1. Oh. Yeah. Zone one. Okay. okay. And your books are available so where? My books, I have my books at uh, Art and Spice Creation in, in the mall in St. George's. Mm -hmm. And of course, whenever we do events like this, you can always get them. And these are all books by authors of the group Canadian Published Authors Inc. So whenever there are events like these and, and um, other types of markets or expos, you'll always find us there. We're a registered non-profit, so we're here to promote reading and writing, uh, promote the culture, promote Canadian stories. So we encourage people to read a lot and also write down the stories and publish yeah. them. Very good. Well, thank you, Mr. Ambrose. Thank you, thank you. Nice meeting you. Same here. So there's some really great local authors here in Grenada. They don't get enough love and support. So if you see any here that interests you, check them out. Some of them are available on Amazon. And some of them you have to go to the bookstores to get them. But look for them, you know, let's support local. So here we have some creations that are made by Gigi. And it's actually called Gigi's Creations. She makes some really beautiful jewelry, as you can see here. And everything is handmade? Everything is handmade, yes. Natural stone, mother of pearl. Mm -hmm. We even have glass, wood. Yes. Uh, uh, um, we have four suede. Okay. Nice. That I used in the creation of these tricolor the earrings. Uh -huh. yes. so these are 30? Yes. EC? EC dollars. I'm located at the Spice Town Mall in between the supermarket and the hardware store. Creative do it best. Yes. yes. Okay. Yes. Well, thank you. Yeah, thank it you was too. nice meeting you. Yes, same here. So, poison orange. All of these were hand created as well. So, these things can be found at Tulubang Green Street, as well as some pop up shops and at Christoph's in the mall. So, you have some options if you like it, and I believe you can also reach out through the website. So, now I'm by PNA's Embroidery and Printing Services. You could embroider personal items, pillowcases, hand towels, rags, uh, bath towels. So you just want to give a gift, you could embroider somebody's name. Or if you want to do mugs, so you could put your photo, company logos, like my company here. Right, so we are located in Windsor Forest, in case you're looking for some. For the cups, 
bigger size is uh, $75, the smaller size is $55. But if you're looking at this set here, mm -hmm. the back towel and then the hand towel and the rag, mm -hmm. I provided the, the towels and this worked out to be $150. Okay. Yeah? So again, it depends on what you want on it. Yeah? Okay. If you have your towels, mm -hmm. um, you can bring it and just pay for the, the embroidery. The embroidery. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. Yes. Well, thank you. You're welcome. White yes. So all the proceeds from these sales go towards helping persons who okay. have disabilities. Which is a really good way to spend your money, you know. You're getting something really beautiful and it's also going to a great do. 85 EC. Yeah. And the purses and so are like purses? Mm. This one is um 55. Okay. So you can find these items at Reflections, which is located at the Craft Center. And I showed it in my video where I was showcasing Kirani James Boulevard and Port Highway. So if you look at that video, you'll see exactly where the Craft Center is located. So you can pass there and check her out. Mango wine. Yeah, that's I made in this Sorry, let's just fresh white like Okay, and then you also make these crochet items, clothing, hats, bags, prices, prices vary from different things, different so prices. 20 US, yeah. and the doctor's going to be 28 US. So that one, where are you located? You can find me on okay, Facebook, which is Local Wines, and I'm also on Instagram, okay. Local Wines. Once it's Local Wines, I'm ready. I'm run by tomorrow. We have some lovely creations here by tomorrow. Hi everybody. Yeah. So here we have our famous tamarind seed earrings and we've added two others to our collection. So this is what we call a cast seed and mm -hmm. um, this is a seed that came out of this part. Oh. So if you see the spaces, mm -hmm. yes. Yeah. So persons have a variety of seeds that they can turn earrings some seeds that they can use and all our hooks are hypoallergenic. Ah, so good, so it shouldn't hurt yeah. your air. No, it shouldn't. Yeah. And um, very recently we've added mahogany bags. Mm -hmm. So this is an earring, it's made from 100% mahogany and another one of the seeds that we use. Uh -huh. This is from the copper pod. So if you look here, you see the natural color in the back. Mm -hmm. And then, you and then we the have these okay. <laughs> All very lightweight, so it's good on the air. Yeah. Uh -huh. And this is a favorite. This is made from vinyl vinyl, which is like a plastic like material. So it's extremely light. So it's oh, flexy. yeah. Yeah, it's not bomb. <laughs> so where can you be found? We have an outlet at the airport, a kiosk at the airport in the check-in in hall. So any, it's accessible to anyone. We also have some of our pieces at House of Chocolates, that's by the museum, as well as some pieces at Calabash Hotel. That's the main place that you can find. Okay. Well, thank you. Most welcome. <laughs> Hi. Your elegant design. Hi. And we have earrings. You awesome. have little top hat things. And fascinators. What are, what are they called? Fascinators. Oh, well, fascinators. Guys, yeah, the fascinators are fascinating me. Oh, that's so <laughs> cute. <laughs> She's located in Lamotte, and you can call her or WhatsApp her, and she does free delivery. All right, so it's a like island-wide free delivery. And what about if somebody overseas wants to go? Well, Bye. <laughs> Nothing set up yet. Well, okay. She's working on you guys. You know, she's working on you guys. But my local folks, check her out. She's in the mode, and you can get free delivery. And as you can see here, it's some really lovely items. Everything is handmade, right? Yes. All right. Here we have Ron Baird. No, I don't know how to And we get to taste it, guys. So, you know, I'm going to taste it. I'm going to be tasting it. Award winner. Two gold, one silver. Oh, nice. Yeah. Coffee, bean, and vanilla. Yes, this one. Sauce up and sea moss and cook one. This one. So, here we have information on pricing. Are these. For sales? Yeah. So we sell these for 20 EC. It's mahogany wood, um, the double sided. And we've put a varnish on it so they're waterproof. Okay, so 20 EC for these. So yes. you, you can put your drinks on them. It's a nice mahogany coaster. So it's fruit infused rum liqueur. Everything's handmade on the island using 100% natural fruits and ingredients. Everything's sourced locally. We have nine liqueurs and then two signature rum cocktails. Oh, nice. Yeah. Okay, so all of these are the business with other people are just and then the signature rum cocktails are these two. Yeah.
that you said are real food. They're real food. So what are the prices like for these? These are all twenty five dollars. These are these are fifteen to twenty. And that's easy. That's easy. Okay. My company's name is Kathy Miranda. Kathy Miranda. Kathy Miranda. Okay. So these here are all my designs. Everything has been handmade uh, with sterling silver, semi-precious stones, some Swarovski crystals. So pieces are bold and colorful. The inspiration uh, came from my Caribbean Afrocentric background. I have a few designs that are my originals and I felt nostalgic. For Grenada, I made something like this. Oh, very nice. Like the soursop leaves. That's what it reminds me of. Okay, soursop leaves. Yes, it does. <laughs> mm -hmm. And you said it's sterling silver, right? It's all solid sterling so silver. So this one is this one costs how much? It's two hundred and ninety dollars. Two hundred and ninety dollars. Yeah. Okay. And this here reminds me of Caribbean waves. Mm -hmm. The design was crafted first in paper, and then I put it into it. So. Um, I just wanted to be able to showcase my work to my homeland. Nice! So do you have any, like a spot where you sell from? I haven't had the opportunity to showcase my work at a few pop-up events, but I do have a small store in Victoria, mm -hmm. uh, Down Street, okay. uh, where we sell other items, but the jewelry is a feature there. Okay. So. Awesome! Thank you! Thank you. Welcome. I got a gift. It's so pretty. Look. <laughs> I have household mm. and I have clothes. Ah. These are household. These are from IKEA. Okay, so like a little cushion type yeah. thing. Yeah, and then I have the lock. Okay. So you can check out Judy in Upper Urban. The boutique is Pops and she brings in Pops from her travel. Yeah, she brings in items from her travels for sale. So here we have some local ground provision flowers by the farmer's daughter. They're located in Black Bay, St. John's. We have the global, we have dashing, we have plantain, we have fig, we have breadfruit, we have cassava, we have tanya, sweet potato, corn as well. How do you sell them, like the different well, sizes? This small pack, uh -huh. normally selling for ten dollars a pack. Mm -hmm. This is about what a crown of provision will come down to okay. after it's dried and everything. Mm -hmm. And this pack is about three times the amount. But we sell this pack for twenty-three dollars. For twenty-three. Yes. For persons on a gluten-free diet, mm -hmm. you use them as they are. Based on what you're doing, if you need a higher yield content, then we recommend that you use wood flour. You just mill it in your a blender, blender. Mm -hmm. for about a minute and then use it with it. I've so made it so add it like as a flavoring mm -hmm. and also you can have your porridge mm -hmm. from any of your ground provision okay so your porridge your provision porridge your logs could be mm -hmm. ready in about five minutes so we have, the, we have so the I like, I like tiny we have the tasty tiny ten different options mm -hmm. you can mix and match to suit this is dehydrated product mm -hmm. it's a dry product so when you add water, just like cream of wheat, it will reheal. Mm. So you don't, get so you don't need to use too much. No, don't use too much. Do not overdo it. Do not go and use a small pack for your load. <laughs> <laughs> so you can contact them on Facebook, the Farm, farmer's farm. daughter. And they also do deliveries. So check them out. So I'm Casey. My Instagram handle is at Casey Dollhouse. I do um, specialize in jewelry, gemstone, painting. And you can definitely find me every Sunday, market day, Atlanta Queens Brewery. And I do some of the resorts and certain pop-ups, but the best way to contact me would definitely be through Instagram at Casey Dollhouse. So we have like natural gemstones, copper, accessories, anklets, bracelets, bead weaving. You know, you name it. Oh, ah, yeah. Awesome. So, sky's the limit. I'm an artist, craft yeah. artist, and you know, this is my stuff. She has some really beautiful yeah. stuff. This is nice. That's natural gemstones. That's carnelian and green agates. Yeah, I'm sorry that everything's bunched together, but we like limited space yeah. today. But all of these are crystals and semi precious um, gemstones. <laughs> okay. Yeah. And then you did these paintings. I did. As well. Yeah. Very nice. Very nice. Thank you. So guys, as she said, you can find her, Casey Dollhouse, on Instagram. Hi, 
uh, I'm Pani from Osha Designs and I make uh, leather products, wallets, handbags, um, anything that people are looking for. So I make bags like mix, uh, mix of material, wood and leather together. So this is a nice little evening bag for example. Nice. Um, uh, another evening bag is this. But that one is very cute. unique. Yes. yes right. Um, then as well as bigger bags like backpacks and it's a, a convertible backpack slash oh, hand side bag. Okay. Um, but I like to mix stuff as well and I do a lot of custom work so mm -hmm. people would contact me and let me know what it is that they're looking for and I work with them. So where where are you located? I am working from home mm -hmm. and I am usually at the bazaars as I don't have a shop mm -hmm. but people can reach me on Osha Designs, Osha underscore designs on Instagram. And guys, fun fact, Auntie Connie, that's how I know her, Auntie Connie. <laughs> because she taught me and my younger brother in primary school. So seeing her here today was really, really awesome. So it was nice to see you again. Nice to see you too. These candles, um, locally made soy wax candles, a variety of scents, and the jars and containers are in different sizes as well. Candles is a hobby that I developed during lockdown. And from that hobby, started a small business. So I've got a variety of different scents. I also do wax melts and candle accessories as well. So my cheapest candle is a travel size candle, which is 10 EC. Mm -hmm. And my most dearest candle is $65. Um, and this is exotic fruit. And you're letting a really nice customized jar. Nice, so where are you located? I currently make the candles from home. I'm not actually located anywhere as yet at the moment. I try to pop up in places like this uh, event. Mm -hmm. um, most Sundays I can be found at um, the brewery mm -hmm. in Latapines on a Sunday morning. Okay, nice. Alright guys, so here we have some locally produced soaps, toner, leave-in conditioner, paint, spray, deodorant, nice, soft scrubs. All of these are yours, yeah? Okay. Where are you located? Okay, I'm located in Westerhall, mm -hmm. so that's a latest. And then on Sundays, I'm usually at the brewery. At the brewery in Western Lake, uh, there, mm -hmm. West Indies, Berries. And on Wednesdays, I'm usually at the farmers market by the East Center. Okay. Yeah. Nice. The name of the company is Naked Products and Bell Organics, mm -hmm. and the products are like naked soap, naked cream, naked oil. Very nice, Dad. So you heard it. You have a few options of where you can, you know, reach her and contact her for her different items. You can also reach her personally on WhatsApp and email. Hi. Hi. These are your Hi. items here? Yes. They are all handmade? I'm yeah, they're all handmade by me. Okay, nice. What's the name of the company? Elegant Designs. Elegant Designs. Designs, yeah. And what are the prices like? Well, I have earrings for 20, 30, 40, 50 different prices. The floral ones in the front are 75. These are 75? Yes. Ooh. Guys, this is an earring. It's very nice. Yeah. So. And I have anklets for 25. Mm -hmm. I have bracelets for 40 and 60. Oh, so these are the bracelets? Yeah. Okay. After you get these for 30. 30? Yeah. And this one is 6. It's Nishka Kroni. And so you can contact her. Here, if you're interested. Sabrina's crochet design. Hi, Sabrina. How are you? Good, and you? I'm good. So, where are you located? I do my business well, online. Online? <laughs> Someone's message me on there and let me know what they want. Mm -hmm. That's how I have WhatsApp businesses as well. So. Mm -hmm. Mainly through there and Instagram. Hi guys, if you saw anything here that you'd like, you know, in terms of the crochet designs and so, you can contact her on WhatsApp, Instagram, Facebook. So just type in Sabrina's crochet designs and you should be able to find her easily. Yes, there are so many different things on display here that it's not possible for me to show you all but I'm trying my best and to persons who are showcasing if I didn't get to showcase your stuff I'm sorry but I'm trying
book it, Trista Orange, which is the Caribbean Creative's Guide to Intellectual Property. And it's written by Daniel Lamont. <laughs> if you scan the code here on the chart, then you get the opportunity to get a portion of the book, a sample. And they're also doing a giveaway, win a free IP assessment. So if you're a creative entrepreneur, you can look into it. So you go to www.juice.orange.com and you can get more details. But it's a great resource for creatives. I haven't read it yet, but I believe in her. So <laughs> it's, I think you should check it out. I think we really need more information in the Caribbean. And in general, like you know, about intellectual property and protecting our rights as creators. So if you are a creator, then check it out. And even if you're not, and maybe you're interested, you can do so as well. This is Connie and she's a designer. She made the outfit that she's wearing. So you know, give us a twirl. Give us a twirl. Yes. Pockets and everything. Oh lovely, lovely. Yes. My name is Connie Zifaria. Mm -hmm. My company is called Zaricon Designs. Currently we're based in Woburn. I've been designing for a long time. Mm -hmm. I started probably when I was like 14. Nice. Doing kind of well design. Mm -hmm. Doing costume and fine arts and sketching and all that. And then I was like, okay, I was feeling fashion. Mm -hmm. So I went to the UK, studied fashion designing at UAL. And I come back, trying to promote my stuff out here and see how it goes. Mm -hmm. So of course, I'm depending on my local people regionally to support the local people too. Mm -hmm. Like I always do, I support the culture. Yeah. And I will always give big up to whatever you're doing, once you sound good and it's good, mm -hmm. whatever advice. If I can help promote, mm. sponsor, I'm there. Okay. So, yes. Awesome. So, Zaricon Design. Zaricon Design. Zaricon Design. Z A R Y C O N. Ah, you see, it's I was like, thinking It's a mix between my two names. Mm -hmm. My first name is Connie. Mm -hmm. Middle name, Zari. So, we combine oh, it with Zaricon Design. That's, that's okay, nice. Okay, nice. It's unique. All right, guys, you heard it. Zaricon Designs. And you are? Uh, Keegan. Keegan. I'm an artist. Uh, I do pop music. I make mm -hmm. commercial music, right? And this is a local piece. This here, and this, this is from Villini Fashion Studio. Big up uh, Villini. Yeah? And what we're working on right now is a tape called Fit in the Hills, and it's a a tape that brings together pop culture and local culture, mm -hmm. and looking to take it to a global stage. 
global yeah. Nice. Yes. So hi, I'm Kalistra, the host of the Narrative, Grenada's number one program. And I've been here for the last three days. I have to say that this is one of the most impressive undertakings of this administration, this new administration in St. George's. Really impressive. I love the way that they've brought the best minds together and all of the talent that we have in the country. And what I saw for the last three days, it is amazing how much people are doing in Grenada, from craft to music to clothing design to we have so much here and if we can harness this Grenada can live all right guys so I really hope you enjoyed today's video I hope you enjoyed coming along with me to day three of the unleashed conference it was really really fantastic just listening to the speakers over these past three days and really just being inspired and motivated and I'm hoping that I can take what I learned and really push to do more you know for you guys and just to grow and develop as a creator and i'm hoping that it has helped other persons who attended as well but i hope you enjoyed the video i hope you enjoyed seeing what some of the creatives had on display and that you will show them some support if you see anything that you like or that you think might be useful to you so thank you so much for watching today's video if you liked it please thumbs it up that really really helps the channel it helps the YouTube algorithm to know that you like my content and it brings more traffic to my channel. Leave a comment, let me know what you thought of today's video. And if you've not yet subscribed and you enjoy my content, then hit the subscribe button and then hit the bell next to it to turn on post notifications so you'll always know when I post a new video. So thank you for watching and I'll catch you in my next video. Bye!